The purpose of today's video is to demonstrate how to use croaker in fishing for bull redfish. But before we do that, I want to mention the importance of prayer because scripture says that Jesus Christ is the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. It also says that all authority in heaven and on earth has been given to him. So you want to catch some fish, some big redfish or something else, make sure you ask the King. And always remember that Jesus is the King. So if you're going to use croaker for bait for bull redfish, now you want an appropriately sized hook, and this is a size 7-0 Kamigatsu octopus hook. And we've used this, and it needs to be a, a nice match for the size of the fish that you have. And you'll see the croaker in a minute. This is a nice size that it goes through the back of the croaker and still has enough of the barb end hit, hanging out to catching the fish when it swallows it. A croaker much bigger than this, you'd probably want to use a bigger hook. Uh, but you need to obtain a croaker, and if you can't buy them, and, and they weren't available in the bait shop uh, when we asked, uh, but you can catch them, and we use uh, just a shrimp and a hook that's a little on the larger size than you usually use for croaker, because if you can get them in the lip, they live longer if they don't swallow the hook, and you want the croaker swimming around down there for a long time, doing its work, attracting the bull redfish. Okay, so this croaker is about right size for bait. He's uh, five or six inches long and you just uh, hold him well in one hand, put the hook through his back, just like that. And uh, we got a heavy sinker on this one because this one, we don't want the tide to take it because we have a lot of other lines already fishing down the with the tide, so this one's intended to hold the bottom. Uh, we're in Caminata Pass, and so this is a uh, eight ounce weight to hold the bottom because we got a little bit of curve. That's all there is to it. Praise the Lord.